How's it going everybody? This is gonna be a quick update video on the Miller v. Becerra slash Freedom Week 2.0 case. Unfortunately, I have some bad news for you guys. Um, the hearing date has been postponed. Originally, um, we were supposed to be getting a hearing uh, March 19th, which is this Thursday, but the hearing has been postponed and is being set for a time to be determined. And the result of this or the cause of this essentially has been because of the virus that's going around. As of my last video, we had the hearing date that was anticipated for this Thursday. But since then, on Friday, we had a lot of courts essentially push out their calendars, um, are closing their doors, essentially saying that because of the virus, they can't have these gatherings of individuals and that they can't hear these cases. And actually on Friday, when I was at work, we got a ton of emails from various superior courts essentially saying that they are closing their doors. One specifically was from the Superior Court in San Diego. And as some of you might know, the um, Southern District Court sits in San Diego. So it was logical that we knew that since the Superior Court in San Diego were postponing and pushing things out, it was likely that the Southern District was gonna do the same. And as of today, we found out that that was the case. And this was also anticipated based on the fact that the Supreme Court of the US today actually announced that they would be postponing all oral arguments. And so once the higher court essentially had postponed everything and pushed everything out, it was very logical and it was very anticipated that uh, the court here was gonna do the same. And so I'll just read for you guys real quick the minute order. Um, the minute order was issued by the Honorable Roger T. Benitez. The minute order states, in keeping with the COVID-19 related recommendations of the United States President Donald J. Trump, as well as medical experts, as to social distancing, the court hereby exercises its discretion and vacates the current motion hearing date of March 19, 2020. Notice of a new motion hearing date and time will be given at a later date. I know it's unfortunate a lot of us were looking forward to it. A lot of us were anticipating this. I was anticipating this hearing. We're really looking forward to Judge Benitez hearing this issue, but based on what's going on in our society right now and based on all the other courts shutting down and based on the various businesses, governments, and all kinds of stuff getting shut down or pushed out, the court here has done the same. So I know it's not the news you guys wanted to hear, but I just wanted to make you guys all aware. I know a lot of you were looking forward to this Thursday and we're looking forward to a decision, but unfortunately it's been pushed out. So we don't know when the hearing's gonna be, but I'll keep you guys updated whenever I get any information on when the hearing date has been set again. There will be a notice of motion hearing that we will receive once the court has set another date. So I will let you guys know when we get that information. Stay safe out there, everyone. I know we've already seen a huge rush against ammunition, against uh, firearm cells. We've seen a lot of stuff happen. We've even seen some cities and some states and some localities essentially saying that maybe they will even start banning the purchase of ammunition or banning the purchase of firearms uh, during these emergency situations. And so if anything like that develops here, or anywhere else, I'll keep you guys updated on that information as well. If you like these videos and you'd like to support the channel, the best way to do that is to join my Patreon, and I'll put links down in the description to my Patreon page. So as always, thanks you guys for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and never forget, a nation that draws a great distinction between its scholars and its warriors, while its laws are run by cowards and its war fought by fools.